by the ultimate blending machine. Oh wait, it's a coffee maker, it's a soup maker. You can get a food processor, best smoothies of your life, and you can do it exclusively here at HSN for not only the very best price, the biggest package. Yes, you can do your own breads. So pizza doughs, focaccias, bagels, breads, your own almond and nut butter, your own rice flour. You can do smoothies and cupcakes and parfaits and salad dressing. Oh my, and quiche and soups. Even use this as your own basically mixer replacement and make your own cream cheese icing. So here's the scoopola. Blend Tech, which is not only American name, legacy and icon. If you're a huge fan like I am, please call us. So it's your coffee grinder, it's your mixer for the icing, it's your food processor, your meat grinder, and so much more. Yes, you can do soups. Yes, you can do smoothies. Yes, you can crush ice. Yes, you can get it on an exclusive flex pay. Eight year warranty, so you get their unique blade design and their unique carafe. All you do is pick your color of choice. And then, basically the bonuses pay for the purchase. Yes, you get what I call their twist and shout carafe. It is the only place in America where you get that. You also get the spectacular spectacula. It does everything that is also included. Oh, and then a quick uh, uh, recipe guide. It's more than a recipe guide. It's in a whole manual and recipe book that is included with your purchase. All you do is pick your color of choice. K Casey is back. And not only am I such a huge fan of you and of Blendtec, I brought my iPad out here so I can finally order one because <laughs> I'm like you. I, I have the other yeah, guy. Yeah, you've been, you've been it's moaning true. and groaning about I that I have. One. Here you are, made in America. You're made in America. Blendtec's made in America, right? I'm actually made in Canada. Oh, that's right. I forgot. But I do we love, love you, that though. This, yeah, <laughs> but I'm basically made in America. <laughs> this is Casey, everybody. And, you know, we only see you when we do a Today's Special. We've yeah. been waiting for this has not been here since last year mm -hmm. it is also on six pay flex pay so it's less than fifty dollars with free shipping to get home we have to show this off because there are so oh many things that make this so gosh. unique i mean this is an hour but i mean we need seven hours we to do. talk about how it's great true. this is okay let's talk about what makes blend tech different because Perfect. i know what the first reaction is from everyone it's oh i've already got a blender it's covered in dust and cobwebs right. and i don't even use it this is the last blender you will ever own because you will never go back to what you used to use. Ever. It's ever. Ever. And plus it has that eight-year warranty you mentioned. I know. So, I mean, I'll be a grandma crazy? probably in eight years. <laughs> <laughs> Think about that. Okay, this is what makes Blendtec different than any other company. The fact that there's so much technology and so much innovation. If you're an engineering junkie, you will love this. Square jar, step one. What does that mean? This five-sided jar with the wild side, right? Right here allows you to put in ingredients that normally you would have to pre-chop, cut up, not even attempt with an everyday ordinary blender. So I've got strawberries with the greens on, cantaloupe with the seeds, apple with the skin. I'm going to toss in some spinach right there on top. I've also got kiwi with the fuzz. Oh, wow. Why not? Why not? A whole handful of grapes. If you oh, did this. Oh, man. I've filled this right to the brim. 90 ounces for your dry capacity or your, your raw ingredient capacity on this. This is a big, huge capacity. This is what the pros use. And literally, this is what your favorite you know, smoothie shops are using, they're using Blendtec, they commercial quality. So let me move this out of the way and show you the real wow. Okay. Here's what sets Blendtec apart also. So by the way, these are buttons. They, they are, are just invisible until... You power it until on. Until you power it yeah, on. Yes, so don't get it at home and go, wait, it has no buttons. Look, you turn on the power and it has presets, which is fantastic. From your batters and your dips to your margaritas or frozen drinks, your smoothies, ice cream, whole juices, hot soup in three minutes, wait until you see that, and the ability to power up and down that speed with the slide of a finger and pulse mode. So I'm going to press the whole juice button, which is right here. Okay. And now, by the way, now that's the sound of power, my that's friends. That's the sound of power. You know, I my rental car, yeah. they gave me a muscle car. I have no idea why, but I was driving it feeling like a total bad you know what driving down the street with a roaring engine and i thought if you want power you need to hear it roar 
so you don't do. get this at home and think it should sound like a kitten because it's not. This is a big motor, 1,650 watts. You can hear it revving up, but you know what? We're, yeah. we're Shannon and I. We're I, not I babysitting In this. In fact, Mark, can we show something? Because anyone who has ever pureed something and it ends more is on the ceiling than in your carafe. Yes. That wonderful, specially sided bottle or carafe, along with that unique blade, and we'll talk about everything that's different, 1,650 watts of power, eight-year warranty, of course, made in America. Mark, can we just show where Casey and I are? And I'll, I'll tell you why. <laughs> because why it's, are we over here? Yeah, it's like, set it and forget it. Go oh, to the totally, gym. Okay, totally. not quite. But it is locked on. Oh, and it shuts off. Huh by itself. All right. It, this is why it has a brain built in. So engineers at Blendtec have figured out the precise time, the precise action that needs to take place to give you precisely the best results. So if Beautiful. you're looking for the best results, and who isn't, then this is the blender for Ooh, you. Ooh, that smells good. Okay, now it's called a whole juice because we've got the fiber intact. If you've ever had a juicer and you're probably still cleaning it from the juice you made two weeks ago, <laughs> and you're swearing under your breath about how big of a pain it is to clean, here you're getting smooth, delicious, professional results. The blender jar itself is dishwasher safe. You can also clean it, you know, lickety split in the yeah. sink as well. But then you get these perfect results. Look and I've that. got a tiny, teeny, weeny little straw here no for you, chunks. Shannon. Okay, so you don't need that special uh, size of a drainage ditch straw <laughs> that they have at the smoothie bar, yeah. right? The big one. The one for um, yeah. bubble tea. Exactly. <laughs> you won't be getting lumps and chunks. Oh, man. That is awesome. Oh, hey, by the way, I'm going to show you what mm. you get, but... If you are one of the tens of thousands of people who already have a blend tech, first time tonight, we have two accessories yes. that have never been aired here at HSN. Both of them could sell out in this hour. Mm -hmm. So this is $40 off. Now, this could be your own little blender to go bottle. Mm -hmm. So you, it also actually has its own little base. basin. So its own little base. Though. So you can make your own individual smoothies. You can make your own individual slush drinks for the kids. Look okay, at how this works. But get this. Yeah. It also fits those little plastic cups that yep. are so popular in university. Right. <laughs> you pop that on top with the yep. blade. Okay. Blend it up on the blender base. And then you've got a little to-go cup. Isn't I mean, that genius? You can start your own little smoothie I was going to say, all right, let me show you what to get. We are Facebooking live in just a moment. I'm, I'm placing my order in just a moment because I've had Blend Tech Envy. Maybe you've seen YouTube. They are famous for golf balls, grinding up pictures of maybe ex boy friends. I mean, <laughs> you name it. There's almost no limit to what you can do. All right. New color selection. Remember, exclusive configuration. Here is our luscious pomegranate. And remember, if it looks like there are no buttons, they magically appear when you power it up. So this will be one of our first colors to go. This is a great gender-friendly kind of universal gray, and it's a nice, beautiful, deep slate gray. I love that one. Orchid is one of our newer colors. Now, if you're saying, I didn't see orchid before, it's because every time Casey is here, this probably was gone before you ever even got a chance to take a peek at it. I'm in love with the sea foam. Uh, my friend Victoria put the name on the back because I always want to rename this color. It's, you know, mint, it's ocean, it's aqua, it's sea foam tonight. And then of course, we've got our classic black. Then of course, you are getting the additional accessories that no one in America does. Made in America, eight year warranty, 1650 watts of power. Like Casey said, no more mixer, no more food processor, no more ice crusher, no more soup maker. I mean, this does everything, makes your own bread doughs. You get this, well, I call it the twist and shout jar. It's the coolest thing if you want to do nut butters or hummus. We're giving you a full demonstration and then the spectacular, what is the official name? I always call it the spectac spectacular spatula. The spectacular spatula. Spectacular spectacula. So that is also an additional bonus. And then check this out. Yes, there's a full, uh, of course, manual, but it's basically a recipe book, a recipe book that you get with your purchase. We're going to show you that if purchased separately, we're going to be Facebooking live. Remember, only here at HSN. So only as long as supplies last as well. So just the blender is almost $450. And then, of course, 
a hundred and thirty dollar bonus on the twist and shout jar. Uh, so it's almost a six hundred dollar package. HSN exclusive configuration. All right, Casey, what do we do next? Let's do a nut butter. Let's do it. Because you started talking about nut yeah. butters and I want to show this off because this is included. So not right. only do you get that big wild side jar that we made that whole juice in, but you also get the twister jar. Now the twister jar, you have to do something with. The other jar, you press a button, you walk away. This one, you have to twist up those ingredients. So I'm just going to power this up and all I have in here are nuts. You can do whatever nuts you want. Right. Nothing is better than homemade nut butter. Check this out. Okay, now what's so wild about this, if you have ever purchased one of those, you know, gourmet, unprocessed, all natural nut butters, honest to goodness, you know, they, now at least at my local grocery store, they're about 10 or $11. So that is a $130 carafe that is included with your purchase. And uh, by the way, mm. that's just the tip of the iceberg. By the way, Paul, we'd love to make margaritas. We might be doing something oh, similar. We will. Uh, yeah, we Amy, are. Amy, hello to you as well. Hey, uh, Casey, how tall is the canter, the decanter, Linda's asking? Well, you know what? I'm glad Linda's asking. The whole yeah. shebang when put together right. with the base is actually 50 15 and a half inches, so it does fit on your kit, unlike the other uh, high-end yes. competitor. Yes. It fits on your countertop underneath your kitchen cabinets. Smooth, creamy, delicious, that. nut butter made fresh. You know, when I go to oh, the store, creamy. my grocery store, it's actually about right. 12 or $13 it is, actually. to get yeah. organic nut butter. Just go to a bulk oh, store. Oh my gosh. <laughs> is that not unreal? Come on. Oh my gosh, that is so good. You can even oh, use wow. hazelnuts with some cocoa oh, powder. Oh my and goodness get that gracious. that chocolatey nut spread. Wow. These are all, you know, there's that saying, food is life. Well, good food makes for a better life. And everything that you put in your Blendtec blender is whole food. So you're only living better. You're only eating better. You're only doing better for yourself and your family when you're using your Blendtec blender. True. Hey, by the way, I just want to point out that uh, that the twist and shout jar, as I like to call it, <laughs> is not available as, as a whole pack. You always buy it separately yeah. if you buy it from somebody else. So that's $130. The spectacular spatula is also included. So let's mm -hmm. talk differences. And certainly everything has its place. This is not to disparage any one particular item. I actually have that, the, the blender you're probably thinking of. I yeah. have one of those. I bought it years ago and it has teeth now why doesn't this have teeth well this has actually one single wing tipped cold forged it's four inches across and this blade is not sharp it's blunt. blunt you can put your hand in there when you're cleaning it yeah. and touch that blade with your fingers you don't have to panic thinking oh my gosh is the blade sharp it is a blunt blade and that's on purpose because blend tech engineers the geniuses that they are discovered that sharp blades make up for weak motors oh when you have actual power behind your product you don't need to have I didn't know that. A hey, sharp blade. You've got a blunt blade to pulverize. Hey Casey, can I ask you something else yeah, too? Why? Please okay, do. this is probably the questions. blender that you see used in smoothie bars. But why? Why is it a square corral? It's square because square causes friction. If you have a blender at home with a round jar, yeah, round most carafe, of them are. Yeah. you get a big empty pocket in the middle of your blending called cavitation where nothing mixes this is hitting against the walls so it has oh. to force those ingredients down gotcha. okay check this out i put rice at the bottom of this blender it's okay. actually below the blade i want you to see that oh it is isn't it's it? below the blade and i want to show you how powerful okay. this is so you could do if you have someone who's gluten intolerant you could be i mean honestly making your own rice flour your own almond flour uh, by the way paul thank you you are, are so kind. I, I so appreciate that. And I hope you guys know how much I appreciate you. You know, I, I so love and appreciate your feedback. And it's so vital to us here at HSN. I think for a lot of us out there, when I said kind of tongue in cheek, that if you've had blender envy, yes, there are a lot of great blenders out there. But this solves a lot of the concerns that people have had, even with their five and six hundred dollar blender. And again, you know, it's not to disparage anything, but blend tech, much like we, we love and 
lo like listening to our customers here, they listen to their customer. And so, Casey, if I'm seeing this right, this, th you could do gluten-free breading for wings. Exactly. This is now your tenders. green meal. You can take yeah. almonds and instead of turning them into almond butter, put them in a little bit less and you've got almond flour. So if nice. you have any dietary restrictions, if you're on, you know, a, if you've been told to try going gluten-free or dairy-free, wait until I show you the almond milk that you can make. Absolutely. From, I didn't even know you could get milk from an I, almond. I know. <laughs> How do you milk an almond? Very carefully. <laughs> uh, all right. Linda is asking, Linda, if we could respond, you know, tell her the measurements again. And then she also wants to know how many ounces on the carafe. So, so 90 ounce capacity when you put in those dry ingredients, but it will eventually settle to 36 ounces on this huge jar. Once so, you've blended everything. Exactly. Gotcha. So I'm doing a citrus berry smoothie. And to answer the question again about the height, all together, 15 and a half inches. Yes, it fits on your countertop because Perfect. that's the most important it question. Is. It is. Is will it fit on my countertop? It's a showpiece. You want to show it off on your countertop and you use it all the time as well. So I'm going to now right. press the smoothie button. By the way, as you do that, Casey, can you talk us through this? So everything has been engineered, basically. Exactly. Right? So when you get this at home, here's the cool thing, and you don't have to call customer service because you hear that? It revs up on its own. It's revving up again now to go even higher. The engineers have figured out the way to get a perfect smoothie. First, you slowly pulverize and crush all those big ingredients. Then you want to whip it up so you get that silky, satiny, smooth, velvety finish, just like you get at your favorite smoothie shop. You can't get that by just guessing with a bunch of knobs at home. Right. Or you know those old blenders from the 70s? There's like 42 buttons and they're sure, all different. Oh, my mom has one of those. They're all different synonyms for puree. And you're like, what's the difference between liquefy, puree? They're all the same to me. This does all the work for you. And in the front on that um, touch screen, it counts down the number of seconds left in that cycle. So if you've got impatient kids, or if you're oh, impatient. It stops itself. It stops itself. So you Goodness. know, if you get distracted and the doorbell <laughs> rings or you're staring at Instagram for maybe a little too long, <laughs> it'll go off on its own. You don't have to worry about it. Okay, check this out. We had frozen beautiful. strawberries. Yes. Do you see lumps? Do you see chunks? No, you don't. That beautiful square jar help to force all those frozen ingredients down Isn't into the blade. Isn't that dynamite? And look at this. I love reading all those incredible reviews yeah. where people go, people love it. this actually does exactly what you say it, it does. It does. Hey, by the way, thanks for all the kind comments on Facebook. Linda and Paul, uh, nice to see you. Mary, hello. Michael just got his foodie. Michael, you're lucky. It was sold out by the time I got it. Ooh. Andre, shout out to your wife, Evelyn, as well. Um, so, oh, why, thank you. You do uh, that. You know, Enjoy. what I'd love to do is show you that if purchased separately. And then I'd love to show you what this replaces again mm -hmm. as well. Because remember, when is a blender more than mm. a blender? It's the same concept that your favorite smoothie or coffee shop so uses. Because you can, you know, grind your own espresso beans you can grind your own flour you can yeah. grind your own you can meat. make hot soup you can make hot I, can soup. I actually start the hot mm. soup because that's three minutes well, and then we can talk about okay, everything else going on and remember when we walk away it's nice to know that the top isn't going to blow off which i think <laughs> is genius but the other thing is, it is engineered with those pre-programmed presets. Now, of course, you can pulse when you want to pulse. I mean, you can do a manual override. But talk about what you're doing right there, Casey. I'm making an apple carrot soup. How delicious is this? Mm. Now, if you're saying, well, wait a minute, I, I don't get how this would make soup. Do I then have to heat it up after? No, you don't. This will heat it up to about 101 degrees using just the power of the blade. That's called friction. When you have a lot of friction, it creates heat. So I turn this on and I will turn raw carrots, raw apple, Beautiful. raw onion, and some seasoning into soup. I press one button. Oh, check that out. And I walk away. And that's it. You can't, you can't open a can of soup out no. of your cupboard. It, it's true. So I, in I'll, that time. We'll show you that if purchased separately, and then I'd love for you to see what this replaces again, and we'll we'll take you on a tour of the colors as well. So honestly, if it's a food processor, it's basically your own soup maker. Oh, thank you, Allison. So remember what I call the twist and shout jar. That's $130 on its own. It is a huge price adjustment off what just the blender itself would sell, sell for. Remember 
remember that twist and shout jar is not included as basically your special package bonus anywhere else but HSN. You get that spectacular spatula and of course a full recipe guide and manual as well. Now I'd love to take you on a tour of what this replaces. Remember, it will grind meat. It'll be your soup terrine. It's your food processor. You can crush ice. It's also your own mixer, your own coffee grinder, all the way down to espresso beans or French roast. Yes, it'll make soups. Yes, it'll make ice cream. Yes, uh, I, I, I think both John and Paul were asking about will it blend? Well, margarita maker, I've actually sold just margarita makers here at HSN for $299. And it's a juicer. But when we were doing that super juice, Casey, you have to remember, a juicer eliminates a lot of what we want, like that pulp the and fiber. the fiber, <laughs> yeah. right? Yeah. And that's what you need in your diet. Um, we're doing that hot, delicious soup. I want to show you something icy cold, too, because let's face it, we all love, hey, I love a good, healthy smoothie as much as the next guy, but what about ice cream? What about dessert? I'm going to make Blendtec's world-famous creamsicle ice cream, thousands of Blendtec recipes. You can search by just one single ingredient on Blendtec's website. But I'm making the world famous creamsicle ice cream right now that has protein powder. Good for you. Right. You could use, here we're using a bit of cream, but I mean, you could always use, you know, almond milk or whatever you want. Right. Cabbage. You're going, okay. <laughs> I don't know what so they do it, in Canada. But so this is a moms bit weird. and dads across America are going, there is no way my kids are going to eat cabbage and carrot ice cream. Avocado. Avocado. We've got an orange, more carrots, toss them in there, and I'm going to top it up with some ice. Pop the ice right in there. Get the lid on top. And don't forget there's an ice cream button as well. So I'm just gonna show you how to access that. When you press the button to turn it on, you'll see right here that little ice cream cone with the soft serve oh, swirl. Neat. Yeah. Okay, and it does it all automatically. Uh, by the way, Rose, we, we see you. She got the sea foam. I'll take you on tour of colors again. Uh, Boho, I love the name, Boho Funk. Got this last time. Loves Ooh, it. Oh, my soup's ready. I, soup's, the soup is Ice done. Ice cream's churning. Soup's, soup's on, ready. Literally. Uh, Brenda, hello to you. And honestly, Ron has a quick question. Can I simply put all the frozen fruit to make a smoothie, or would it need some liquid? So if you did only frozen fruit... Actually, you did the cream you can use, you, you can use um, with no liquid. Yeah, the first one that we did, yeah. which was the total juice, yep. no liquid. No We're liquid. Just using the liquid from yeah. the fruit. Okay. There you go, Ron. I've okay. got my carrot, my delicious carrot soup that I made with the apple in it. I want you to see this. I'm going to take okay, the wait, lid let's off. Okay, wait till the uh, perfect oh. case. I just want him to see the steam. Did you see the steam? All right. Did you guys, you guys see apron? that steam? Awesome. Thank oh you. Oh my gosh, that looks so good. And what a vibrant gorgeous color look at this oh man oh my gosh you think about going to your favorite little bistro your favorite little restaurant where they've got that amazing homemade soup yeah and you get so excited to head on over there how about staying put how about wearing your pajamas Isn't at home that unbelievable you know what's not in here though shannon it's extra sodium. I was going to say, or artificial number, whatever, whatever, whatever. Oh uh, when you see that tomato soup from the store, and not to be disrespectful, you guys are smart shoppers. You know that color is not from nature, right? <laughs> yeah. So a couple of things. If you want the, the on-the-go blender, and basically it has its own blender base. It does. Own blender base, the craft, that wonderful stamp and go lid. But remember, it also works with your little, you know, solo cups. So we have fewer than a thousand. Fewer than a thousand of these, twenty-two dollars and forty-nine cents in your credit card. And that's the launch today. Yep, first, brand you new. You guys are the first brand ones new. to ever get your hands on. And that. then we also have a brand new blender book. Which remember, you can always go to the Blendtec website to get another copy of their manual or to download, you know, any recipes or your favorite social media. But this is a fantastic recipe booklet. Remember, you get a great recipe book with your purchase. I'll show you that again. But if you want an you know, other great ideas to spur your creativity. This is also available. You know, I got to try that ice cream. I, you? I have to try the ice cream. What about me? So remember <laughs> this had... <laughs> Wait a minute. No, what okay. about me, Shannon? So refresh remember this, everybody's memory. Yeah. Cabbage. This, this had cabbage. Carrots. Carrots. Right. Avocado. Right. In the ice cream. And look at what it looks like now. And please give it a taste. Oh, man. And for the ice cream alone that okay. you can make. You can make frozen yogurt. Your yeah. favorite froyo. Your sorbets with fruit. This has that veggies. That is so unbelievable. 
It's unreal. Oh, what? Is it the avocado that gives it that creaminess? Mm -hmm. Oh, man. It tastes exactly like a creamsicle. Mm. Like an orange oh, it creamsicle. does. And guess what? Wow, wow, wow. You're getting wow. your serv servings of veggies, wow. eating ice cream. It's true. Mm. You, you can trick the kids into eating cabbage and carrots. Oh, All my right. gosh. That's so ridiculous. so yummy. Good. Remember, Casey has not been here since last year. Uh, uh, Mark, I'll just show colors again real quick. Yes. And rem remember again, um, actually, uh, Allison, which color is selling the most rapidly? So pomegranate gray. Okay, pomegranate will actually be our first to go, which I, now I'm changing my mind. I was gonna order the seafoam, but now I'm looking at that pomegranate. <laughs> okay. Oh, actually, I'm sorry. We have fewer of the seafoam, and then the orchid is this great purple color. Gray, if you're undecided. Pomegranate, that great red. Classic black, of course. Remember what I call the twist and shout beaker or carafe. That's $130 value. Your spectacula, spectacula. And then, of course, here's that other recipe guide and booklet. All right, so only here, only for today. Uh, Casey, I tell you, we got a lot of stuff we have to get through. Right uh, in the Watch next how fast minutes. I can do it. Okay, pesto. so this is pesto. Twister jar, fresh basil, avocado, nice. pine nuts. And literally, these recipes take, I mean, seconds. 20 seconds? They Pops. do. Uh, by the way, uh, one thing that's a little different with the, the twi what I call the, the twist and shout <laughs> carafe is, um, mm. I call it <gasps> twist and shout because those little arms, you just want to give it a little extra, um, um, just twist them a little well, bit, Well, and right? here's how you know when to use the twister jar. Okay. If it's thicky or sticky, hummus, <laughs> baby food, really thick shakes, pesto and you get perfect results every time okay we do I hey by the way yeah. boho funk we'll see if we can uh, post the ingredients for the avocado cabbage carrot ice cream but real quickly <laughs> orange cabbage carrots it has avocado a little bit of orange extract yep. protein powder in there oh this is, i'm glad i spilled it on here i want to show perfect. you really quickly you can just give that a wipe but that go jar that's so so popular yeah. i want to show you something really cool so okay. you talk about the fact and this is this is brand new this is an extra Nice. item if you want to purchase it but you basically are just going to either pop the blade on top flip it upside down and go right but i want to show you something cool you and what's weird is so it does come with this it comes with this little blender base it, that screw that pops on it does. today's special or, gotcha. or okay. you take a plastic cup and rest it inside just a, your standard plastic cup my, from yes, the supermarket exactly my kids are obsessed with this pop the base right on top like Oop, just has Perfect. to go. Like, obviously, I wasn't, you know, doing very well in geometry and in, in user <laughs> error, as they say. Then look, you awesome. mix up your own drinks in seconds while that's going over okay. there. Hey, by the way, Candy, hello to you. Bill, hello to you. Ron is upgrading. Hi. He's got the old, you know, blender with the old buttons. Oh, he's um, got the old buttons uh, with the food <laughs> stuck in them. <laughs> Bill says it makes everything nice and perfect. Uh, Boho Funk, hopefully you got the ingredients. All right, what are you making for us now? Snow, because I know what you're thinking. I know there's still a few people out there. Right. The skeptics that go, mm-hmm, I noticed she hasn't done ice. It probably can't Can blend ice. Can I ask ice. you something? Why do, they, why do they tell you not to do ice in the regular blender? You know, <laughs> because, because the motor I mean, will burn out. And so you that's know that it starts smell. to smoke and smell and everything this else. This has all metal, direct drive. Wow. Check this out. And now of that on-the-go cup and carafe. And remember, that comes with its own little blender base that pops on. So if you have a, a oh blend gosh, tech from before, so it will with your work with your blend tech from before. It absolutely so. will. And then look what I do. I oh, take nice. my little lid and my straw. Boop. Perfect. And I blended it in the cup. Isn't that genius? Isn't hey, that real cool? quickly, Casey mentioned something called direct drive. And mm -hmm. so no pieces, parts, plastic melting, That's gears it. whirring. So this is, you know, metal to me. I mean, this is as close to a lifetime, you know, blender as you're ever going to get. And, oh, okay, talk about what this we're seeing is, here. Okay, that was Blendtec's front entrance on their building. This is what it looks like in their manufacturing facility, Orem, Utah. 400 American families thank you so much when you purchase your Blendtec blender because they have jobs because of you amazing facility and when we say made in America it's not one of those made in America well only the lid no right. every Good component point. they have worked so 
hard so that there is not a single offshore part being oh, uh, coming onto those blenders. It's margarita time. It is. Hey, Michael, well, from margaritas to hot chocolate, Michael wants to know if he can do hot chocolate. Casey. Yes, you can do hot chocolate. Yeah. You could do your frappes. You could do your lattes. You could do. I did a turmeric latte Ooh, in nice. here the other day um, for a friend. Delicious. And look at that. For those of you that have, yeah. you know, I used to have that three hundred dollar margarita maker. Mm. <laughs> this makes margaritas. It does. And it does a whole lot more. Absolutely. Hey, Amanda or, or, or Victoria, I'm putting one of these in the freezer. Boho Funk, let's get the recipe <laughs> for the ice cream. I'll put that on my Facebook after the show and then I'll have a snack. Uh, but we are Facebooking live. Yeah. Remember, we've got a couple of demonstrations that we have to get through here. So what's next? I'm doing some brownies. Okay. those ingredients in. Here's what oh, Blendtec Casey, blenders wild. don't have. Blendtec blenders don't have a stir stick on the top because you do not need it. Your ingredients just get blended. Okay, so remember, it's your mixer, it's your food processor, it's your meat grinder, it's your you juicer. can it's your juicer, it's your ice cream it's, maker, it's your ice cream it's maker. Your maker, it's your soup maker, it's your best friend, it's your best friend, <laughs> it's easier to clean, it's a perfect profile. This is something that shocked a lot of people. You can actually make your own almond milk. You can. You can make your own almond milk. So all we have is some almonds that we blanched overnight. Right. And then we've got a pinch of sea salt, some vanilla, and the rest is water. No, nice. it cannot get easier. It cannot get fresher. Oh, wow. If you're trying to eliminate dairy or reduce dairy or you're allergic to dairy, now instead of getting the Tetra Packs of almond milk that are not so fresh, perhaps, at the store, you can do it yourself. It's about taking control over yes. your health, taking control over what you feed yourself, your family. chicken, ground it up, froze it in the freezer into little, you know, little tiny balls and made little dog treats. Cooked oh, chicken. Oh, what a little cute dog treats. Idea. Isn't that fun? It is. Hey, Casey, did we do a turmeric drink? Boho Funk was asking. I must have oh, missed that. I mentioned it. I oh, said okay. I made a turmeric latte. Oh, aren't you um, fancy? I know. She's, She's fancy. Oh, I'm with so her fancy. blend tick. That's what we do. Fancy, fancy. Yes, you have to talk with an accent. <laughs> okay. But look at this. This is all milk have you seen anything oh, creamier crazy. and delicious okay oh my gosh how good is that oh, that's wild oh my gosh okay so good let me just give you a little Ooh, refresher everything we did here okay sorry get my steps in get my steps in <laughs> so the green drink remember didn't el eliminate the fiber mm -hmm. it was full to the top homemade peanut butter beautiful smoothie this all started Don't with my rice flour oh, rice flour ice cream i'm gonna post that recipe victoria if you can help me coordinate getting that i'll do that on my facebook mm -hmm. then of course homemade pesto margaritas oh we didn't do the carrot cake icing should we, we do that later okay, we'll, we'll squeeze it but There's you can so do icing do. uh your own brownies because it replaces your mixer mm -hmm. making your own almond flour oh my gosh so we've got other goodies to show you remember hsn exclusive this was missing for over a year we're including goodies that nobody else is doing you just pick your color of choice so it appears that the sea foam sea foam rather and the orchid will be the first to go. Those are the most limited out of the colors that we have. If you missed it, I will show you again. Eight-year warranty made in the United States, 1,650 watts of power. Just the blender carafe, or what I call the twist and shout jug or jar, is $130 value on its own. So the blade design, the motor design, the beaker or the carafe design, all unique and exclusive. Chances are this is the same blender that you've maybe seen on YouTube with golf, you know, balls and everything else. One billion views. One billion views, oh my gosh. To everything from hot chocolate, smoothies, soups, and you know, ice cream drinks and everything in between. So that unique design, remember the carafe, the blade, everything is unique and different. That direct motor drive, so you're not worrying about plastic gears and pieces burning out. Unique five-sided jar. Now we do have a four-sided one if you want an extra 
different jar. Yeah. I mean, that's also available. The $130 twist and shout jar is also included. Full, full, full. This, this is so crazy. I mean, it's like a separate recipe book. That's for the twister jar. That's for the twister jar. And then, whoopsie, do I have it out here? You all do get a full man, uh, manual as well. Mm -hmm. And of course, you can go to the Blendtec website. So $130 worth of bonuses conservatively. Quiches, ice cream, cauliflower pizza crust, rice flour, everything in between. The uh, blender carafe alone, or the blender is a $450 value. By the way, we're continuing to Facebook. Of course, we'd love to say hi to you. Don't let this sell out from underneath you. And I'm speaking from experience because every time you hear Casey, we lose by the end of the well, day. Because usually we do the last because show. Because usually you and I do the last show. And yeah. then it's like, I've got 400 black. And you know, and that's it. So you snooze, you lose. You saw what happened with our Ninja Foodie earlier this week. Mm -hmm. So this, there's a 30 day money back guarantee. So if you're saying, oh, I've got the other one or I'm not so sure, or is, you know, is a blender really that different from another blender? You've got a month to really to prove yourself wrong. If you've had Blender Envy, people who have tried their Blend Tech are absolutely in love with it. Let's start with some of the basics, though, because when we say, yes, it replaces your soup maker, ice cream maker, meat grinder, even if you just did juices in this, right? And that's what I'm going to show you. It's about the square jar. With Blend Tech, it's about technology and engineering. This is a company that's devoted its life to creating the world's most advanced blender, the last blender you will ever own. Square sides mean you don't need to take the lid off and stir those ingredients. That creates friction instead of a circle, which creates cavitation, a big empty hole. Then you've got that clear touch interface. Press one button to power it up, and you can see that you've got some pre-programmed settings. You don't have to use them, but they're here to give you perfect results. If you want to take control, you can do that yourself. There's also a pulse mode right there. But I'm going to turn it off and turn it on, and I'm going to show you a whole juice. We're doing carrot pineapple juice. So we've got carrot and we've got pineapple. I would add a knob of ginger in there. It's just so fresh and so delicious. When you go into any grocery store now, healthy foods dominate. And yeah. the price tags are ridiculous. Uh, yeah. Because they're using Blendtec blenders to make right. those really expensive juices. Why don't you just use a Blendtec blender? NSF certified, by the way, which is the National Sanitation oh, wow. Foundation. And that's because every detail from the jar onwards is created for perfect hygiene. When you're washing and cleaning it, for example, there's a hole in the bottom. So you never have that oh. gross, filthy dishwater buildup. Yeah. Everything is created for commercial quality perfection. So we've got our delicious carrot juice. We've got oh, pineapple man. in here. It's fresh. Freeze it into popsicle molds even oh, for the that's kids. that's a cute idea. It would be so fresh it and is. so delicious. Linda Love Love loves her blend tech. Alan, hello to you. Angela, hello to you as well. Hi, Actually, Al. Armani had a great question, and Armani wants to know if that other carafe will work with the older blend techs. Yes. So oh, it, good, good idea. Any yeah. blend tech blender that you have ever seen here at HSN, there's only one really old model that right. we've never even had here at HSN. That's the only one it won't work with. Okay. Every other Blend tech base, go for it. 1,560 watts of there power. There you go. We'll show you that item number again. Uh, so hopefully that uh, helps you out there. So again, the carafe, Armani, in case you missed it, will work. Oh, he, he's asking the total blender blend tech. Yeah, of the, course. Yes. It will. It will. Okay. And so um, with this configuration today, and that's great. I'm glad he's asking that question because tens question. of thousands of you already have yeah, a blend tech blender, and yeah. it's great to have those little add ons. Yeah. But here I've got almonds in my twister jar. The twister jar is part of this incredible value. So I'm going to fire Great. it up. By the way, that what I call the twist and shout uh, carafe is $130 and only included here at HSN. What's interesting is Heather was saying that she bought her Blendtec Designer 650 at the full price and it was worth every penny. Honestly, it's, it's really something that whether you're trying to reduce fat, 
fat or sugar or you're trying to eat healthier, you're trying to get those fruits, you're trying to get those vegetables, you're trying to get all those mm. good things in your diet. And uh, Casey, your recommendation, when do I use the twist yeah. and shout carafe? What's, as you say, <laughs> sticky or thicky? Or thicky. I love that you've given it your own name. The twist and shout. <laughs> the twist and shout. Hey, the only reason you may be shouting is, holy cow, can you guys believe I just made yeah. my own nut butter, my own almond butter. Isn't that crazy? Dishwasher safe, which is fantastic as well when it comes to these jars. They are made of Triton co-polyester, so that's like the strongest, right? Yeah, yeah. so it's that's you the know, strongest. If, if, if you do get a little too enthusiastic right. and you toss it up in the air, nothing's going to happen. Let's okay, talk let's, about the blade. let's do that because when you look at it, the first thing you're going to say, the first thing I said is, well, that doesn't have any teeth. That's not going to do anything. And then you look at the shape of the carafe and you go, mm -hmm. what's going on here? Yeah, you're like, why right? is it square? Why is the blade blunt? The blade is blunt for a reason. Four inches of cold forged steel, wing tipped on the ends, all metal gearing. What gives out on any blender? It's that direct drive socket because that's always plastic. Well, here it is and it's metal and you've got this incredible blunt blade and why is it blunt why isn't it sharp first of all you can actually when you go to clean it put your hand in there right. and you don't have to worry about it but why is it blunt because blendtec has power you don't need a sharp blade so when you don't got, need the blades you do not blendtec engineers discovered that all those blenders that have sharp blades actually have weak motors oh, and wow. they're trying to compensate okay, the first time i saw casey do that, i'm like what is she doing? She's gonna make popcorn in that thing? No, you yeah. have to tell them what I you're wish. doing. <laughs> so I'm using this as a grain mill. We've used it as a whole juicer. We've used it as an ice cream maker, a soup maker, a food processor, a chopper. I wanna show you something pretty cool. I'm gonna rev this up. Okay. Whoa! First of all, if you've ever had a piece of corn stuck in your teeth for like a month and you have to go to the dentist to have it removed, it's hard, it hurts. It is. You need quite the power Below the blade. Uh, yeah, you Did know you what? See I, was, that? I was just going to mention. Uh, hey, by the way, Allison, can we put the graphic for the, what I call the to-go container on? Uh, Linda's asking for the item number for the little to-go cup. By the way, we are fewer than a thousand of that brand new, first time ever to-go cup, mm -hmm. and that is six six zero six seven six. So six six zero six seven six. Linda, yes, we just made soup. Tanisha was just asking about that. Thank you for helping us out there, Linda. I love that Bill is going to be making uh, actually some hot chocolate with ice cream. Ooh, I mean, you can make the whipped cream in here too. Oh, you oh. put a little bit of whipping cream in, in, in your Blendtec blender because, hey, let's face it, if you're doing hot chocolate or anything, you want the whipped cream on top. Um, okay, back to health, Casey. Focus, back to health. We've got the focus. <laughs> yeah. focus. No whipped cream. No more delicious. whipped cream or margaritas for you. Here we've got the <laughs> Jolly Green smoothie. That's healthy, right? It's got mm. spinach. And you know that saying, if you're green inside, you're clean inside, right? So <laughs> maybe not. Shannon's like, what saying? Okay, I'm going to fire this up. Don't forget you've got your presets. So right. all I have to do is put my ingredients in, press smoothie, and walk away. Okay. Jolly Green Smoothie has almond milk. Remember we just Ooh. made that fresh, delicious almond milk? Well, now we can take that almond milk and we can turn it into a smoothie. You can put your jar in the refrigerator on the top shelf it'll fit there as well and you can keep your smoothie there for later on in the day the best part about that little to-go cup that we'll talk about again in just a sec that is not included that's just a fantastic brand new Blendtec accessory launching yeah. here today brand is that you new. can make it personalized grab it and go without having to transfer it over to a different container but look at how gorgeous isn't that this awesome is. hey by the way Armani you are so welcome uh Oh, oh, Janet, good question. 30-day money-back guarantee. Yes, we actually print the return label, which is really handy. When I've sent some stuff to my mom in Minnesota, then all she does is peel off the little sticky and put it on the box. So, Janet, we yes, we do all that for you. Deanne, my love, my sweet friend. Hello, Deanne. Great to see you as always. Linda, you are so sweet as well. I love you guys and gals. And here's something that you will love. What's interesting is um, my, my 
producer and friend, my sister, uh, Allison is producing tonight, and she's like, well, healthy is good. She's got two little girls at home, and she's like, what about the not so healthy? Oh, like ice cream? Like, hmm, ice cream maybe? So tell them what you did here. Here we're doing a blueberry ice cream. So we're using cream. We're going full fat or go home. We've got <laughs> all the goodies in here. We've got some blueberries. I like to use wild blueberries. You know what? Frozen fruit is often way less expensive than fresh fruit. No, you're right, actually. So get yourself a bag of frozen fruit and some ice. Power it up. Press that little ice cream cone. Nice. And do the walk away. Right. You can do the walk away. Or you can stand there and stare like uh, a lot of or, people do. Exactly. You could easily. All right. I'm going to place my orders. So uh, I've had Blendtec Envy for a while. Mm -hmm. Remember remember the old days we had to have the salt and freeze the carafe overnight. Oh, my God. Yeah. You know, all oh, that. Yeah, you wanted ice cream. It's right. like, now put it in the freezer for 24 hours. I You're know. Like, I want it. I want I it don't now. Wanna wait 24 hours. And that is the power in the pigment, Deanne. You're so sweet, Robert. You are a doll. We just appreciate you here. Hey, by uh, by the way, uh, Janet, or is it if it's pronounced Jeanette? My apologies. Just a quick couple of housekeeping issues. If you are new to HSN, everyone can use FlexPay, which is that's actually what I'm doing to get mine at home because you know. <laughs> Things are a little tight around the house right now, so I'm doing flex pay of less than $50 on my credit card. It's free shipping, and then we do print the return label if you decide for whatever reason you don't want it. Now, this is, uh, we put the number up for Linda moments ago, but I'd love to do it again. Yeah, I'm the, gonna whip that up. This in just is a your what, um, first time ever we're doing this to go mm. carafe. Comes with its own blender uh, attachment or base. It will fit on older blend techs, so will. just FYI. They're always universal, the they base. Are. So 660-676, and we have fewer than a thousand of those to go around. And guys, you tell me when I can go walk to the color position. Oh, oh, gotcha, after we start the soup. Okay, I just wanted everybody to see the, the colors again mm. real quickly. Check out All right. the color Check of that blueberry this. ice cream. Ouch. Okay, Shannon, you need to go for right. that while okay. I go for the go. Do you know what? Blueberry ice cream is like my favorite ever, 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 ever. Okay. Okay. What, what I, is this in there? This is a little go cup. Yeah. I'm just going to show you how to use it. Mm. Pop your ingredients in. Oh, that's it upside good. down. Wow, this is wow, a wow. chocolate peanut butter protein smoothie. Sounds like the perfect so end to a like day. Chocolate milk. So chocolate peanut butter protein. Chocolate and some protein and powder. And some protein powder. So okay. I'm just going to press my little smoothie button. Okay. And don't forget, here's another amazing feature of this little, this is, this is a, you know, brand new today type of a cup. Fits right on top of your Blendtec base, but it also fits these plastic cups that oh, we all enough. have kicking around. So you just insert the plastic cup with your ingredients, put the lid on top, flip it upside down, and you get your perfect results. So let's say I want to just oh, grab wow. this and go to the gym with it. I just <laughs> because don't we all just go to the gym with our chocolate <laughs> peanut butter? <laughs> Sorry, let me rephrase that. You pretend to go to the gym because you're wearing your gym clothes, but you actually stop off somewhere and just yeah. window shop now. Or you want to look like you just came from the gym. Exactly. <laughs> With your bad head, you're like, oh, you oh are yeah. too funny. Me? I mean, I was just working so out. So we have fewer than a thousand <laughs> of those to go around. Uh, by the way, Candy, Linda, Paul, you guys are so lovely. The residuals, the checks in the mail, you are, you're fantastic. And yes, sticky or uh, thicky, thicky will be my new catchphrase as we move forward. <laughs> Thicky or thicky, you gotta exactly. love it. Exactly. Uh, honestly, Paul, we see you. Thank you for Facebooking live. Okay, so speaking of sticky or thicky. This is the perfect time to use our twister True. jar because this is sticky and thicky. Mm -hmm. It's our cilantro hummus. So I'm just gonna fire it up and give it a twist. And remember, now that's the $130 addition that we are including with your purchase. So remember, any place else that you shop for Blendtec, you buy that, what I call the twist and shout jar, you buy that mm. separately. Hey, by the way, we haven't shown you the spectacular spatula, oh, why to. it is spectacular. Mm. It actually looks a little, they're <laughs> like, lay off the anti-inflammatories because... I like a little song and dance, personally. <laughs> Okay. I'm not going to complain. <laughs> but it actually has like a little subtle curve to it, it right? It does. So this is designed to give you the perfect scrap, scrapage off the sides so that you don't lose a single ingredient. But look at how beautiful that is. This is chickpeas, cilantro. Oh, we have man. garlic in here. You know what I made the other day? Speaking huh. of fantastic recipes we need to share, huh. dark chocolate hummus. 
Oh, really? Dark chocolate hummus. It was ridiculous. It had no added sugar. It was just a little bit of pure maple syrup with cocoa powder and the chickpeas. Oh, no kidding. Vanilla. Oh, my gosh. Wow. And you dipped graham crackers in it. For sure. Hey, by the way, in case, because, listen, I'm a recipe queen. We got to show you the soup, and then I'll show you the colors. Oh, I'm going to um, go start this. Okay, soup. sounds good. But remember, you can go to the Blend Tech website, and yes. if all you can remember is ice cream, you know, do in their little search engine, yeah, the recipes will come cream, up. Yeah, just type in ice cream. Type in, Absolutely. So if there's something that we're not covering or listing, um, if you go to the Blendtec website, okay, what was that now? What are this you doing? was just broth and some seasonings. Okay. Some just salt and pepper, but we're doing um, a delicious broccoli cheddar soup. So this is not even cooked broccoli. This is just the raw broccoli your kids are turning their noses up at. So like stock or, blo or uh, broth, broccoli raw, cheddar. Broccoli raw, cheddar raw, and okay. then we've just got the stock, and then we've got salt and pepper, basically, is the bottom right. line for this. Make sure your it, lid is make on sure tight. Make sure it's locked. And then you press your soup button. There's a little bowl of steamy oh, soup. That. And three minutes. Three minutes. And what's so dynamite, I, the, the, the couple of things I want to point out. It is truly a set it and forget it. Mm -hmm. Number two, it's, it's not even how much you're spending or how much you're saving. It's what this replaces. Mm -hmm. So we'll show you that again. Remember, it is your mixer. It's your food processor. It's your juicer. It's your meat grinder. It's your ice cream maker. Yes. Obviously, it's your blender. It's your one thing we haven't done. We did grind our own almond flour, but you could do your own espresso beans. You yep. could do your own coffee drinks with this. You could do so much. You Even could. if you want to make a simple coleslaw, oh. take your head of cabbage, cut it in half, plop it in, add a little bit of water, pulse, pulse, pulse. It chops up the whole shebang. Oh, no kidding. Strain out the water. Boom. Coleslaw. Oh, wow. You didn't have to do a single thing. In fact, I would add your carrots in there, oh, too. that's good. And then use your twister jar to make your coleslaw dressing. That is awesome. How perfect is that? Hey, by the way, I am going to show you colors again. And remember, if you want the sea foam, here's your sea foam. Uh, there are only a few hundred of the sea foam. Sea foam and then the orchid, orchid. were so the popular. first colors to sell yeah. out when Casey was here last time. Remember, we only do this like, you know, once a year. It's been, you know, we haven't seen Casey since last year. So here's that great pomegranate, or I'm sorry, the orchid rather with that nice purple. There's your gray uh, pomegranate. I was really torn between sea foam and pomegranate. I did go team red because that's kind of tradition with me. So there's your, your team red. There's your pomegranate. And remember, it is this, well, it's today and today only, only as long as supplies last. Well, um, and can I say one thing yeah, about go. that? Is these are... Like I said, 400 families work on these out of Orem, Utah. So this isn't an offshore operation where trillions are churned out per day, yeah. which is why I'm not here very often. Yeah, that's actually because true. Because these families have to make your blenders for they you. Do. They do. And along with that, and if you miss some of the factory footage, it's amazing. Made their in the United door, States. Their front door is a blender. <laughs> it's right. Isn't that that's funny? Their front door. It's Eight hilarious. Eight-year warranty. Eight-year warranty. Uh, so uh, again, we see everybody. Uh, I love Jeff is actually double dipping watching from both phone and TV how cute uh, Tanisha is asking about a good hollandaise sauce I bet you could make a killer oh hollandaise sauce God. in this so creamy and it delicious would. Uh, Jackie hello to you as well Mary just got hers in red Mary I, I'm not gonna have Blendtec Envy anymore I got my red which is the pomegranate in case you're keeping mm. score at home so that was what again Casey this is a coconut lime slush and what's in there some alcohol Alcohol. <laughs> I don't remember what I happened probably shouldn't have been, that. Instead of them keeping the ice cream <laughs> for me when I'm off the air, this is what we should have for me when I get off the air. Seriously. So it's mm, like coconut. Just give that a sniff. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> I've got two more hours with coins, and I think Mike Mizak <laughs> would like me to be able to focus. So sadly, I'll have to <laughs> pass. Yeah. Oh, you know what? Glo Gloria would like to see it used as a meat grinder. I apologize. We don't have that demo set oh, up tonight. we do not, but, but I have done that before. It's okay. super simple to do. You take your beef or your chicken or whatever it happens to be, use the pulse mode, and it literally minces it up for oh, you. Nice. So okay. perfect. So you do can you make your own burgers. I do my oh, own burgers, yeah. but I start with, you know, chicken breasts, and then I turn into 
the chicken burgers. Right, even for the pets, these, too, for uh, cats and dogs. And, oh, yeah. Um, yes. uh, do you, should you chill the meat? Any recommendations? Yeah, you know what? The might colder the meat, you're right. The say. colder the meat is, yeah. the easier. Luckily, in my household, I usually forget to take it out of the freezer, so it's <laughs> right. Well, cool. there you go. <laughs> okay, so talk about what you're making, and then I'll show colors real quick. Yeah, so we're gonna, going to do some peanut butter cookies. So we've got our Oh, eggs. you put the whole eggs in. Isn't yeah, that funny? So imagine using this instead of your stand mixer. I mean, hey, I love the look of a good stand mixer on the countertop, too, but sometimes it's a little bit, you know, of, of a hassle to get that going. When right. you've got your Blendtec blender, don't forget, I never show you the pulse mode. Oh, yeah, it looks like a little heartbeat. It does. Isn't that funny? Exactly, it looks like a little. It does, but it's pulse. It's I mean, a little oh, how pulse. funny, how tongue-in-cheek is that? I know. It's, so it's Blendtec has a good sense of humor. They do. It's literally, you know, tongue-in-cheek. So here's the thing. We see you there. Uh, Gloria, uh, she heard how to do the meat, so thank you for that question. But remember, it re it's not how much you're spending, and it's really not even how much you're saving, although that is important. It's about what this is replacing. It, it, and making your life easier yeah. and giving you, oh my gosh. Like, have you ever seen oh, a isn't smoother... That batter in your oh, entire man. life. Wow. Um, it's all about making your life easier and giving you access to all of those fabulous foods and recipes that you cannot get the results. It's true. You cannot achieve the results with an everyday blender. You can't. By the way, Boho, we love you. Zachary, hello to you as well. Deanne, all my love. Mom and dad say hi to you. Gloria, I'm so glad you gave us that suggestion. And remember, we're closing it. These are the last couple of minutes of the show. Casey is not back live until early in the morning. One quick thing about the peanut butter cookies. Try uh, Just conceptualize how hard it would be to clean that other carafe with the mm. teeth. Mm -hmm. You'd have... Oh you, my gosh. It, it would be there forever. You'd be tasting peanut butter. You would. Seriously. <laughs> and you know what? That's another hygiene issue. That's why I like to point out that this is NSF certified is because you can get under the blade to clean it out. You can. How many times do you look at those old blenders yeah. under the blade and you're like, oh, uh, like... I know. Hey, that? Casey, I, I hate to rush you, but can we show the finished soup and let's... We're also doing <gasps> those, those energy bites that are so big. Balls. Yeah, we've okay, got time. Perfect. Okay, check it All out. Right, do you see the cheddar. steam? All right, see there we the go. Steam. Okay. Steamy, delicious. I know. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm going to have so to try good. a bite now, of that. How did it give me these results? Yeah. Because we've got. 1,560 watts of power. So in three minutes, you get nice. creamy. You can see how creamy it is. Creamy, delicious, velvety results in no time. All right, Candy, you can tell your hubby I've got a girl crush on you too. And Mary wants to know about mashing potatoes in it. Yeah, Actually. you could put, well, you could put potatoes in here, but you know, if I was doing a smaller batch, I'd use the twister jar uh, for that. I was just going to say. Yeah, that's a better Because that's sticky bet. and thicky. It is sticky <laughs> and thicky. I know, okay. Let me just show you colors before we run out of time. And remember, it's it's less than $50. Boy, Paul, thank you for the call out on that flex peg because sometimes I get so excited about what this does, I forget to mention some of the basics. So yes, it's less than $50 on your credit card with free shipping. Uh, Jeanette or Janet, my apologies on the pronunciation. She was asking about the return label. We even print the return label so that all the heavy lifting is done for you. And those are those kind of energy bites that are like all the rage at the uh, health food store right now. But you're in complete control of the ingredients. And that's the one thing. Sometimes we're buying quote unquote a health food, but it's not always the healthiest because they do put sugar and lots fillers of sugar and, yeah, salt for sure so uh, Pinterest has lots of terrific ideas and recipes so my pomegranate that beautiful rich kind of cranberry red is actually in the lead gray orchid and sea foam are the most limited and those were the colors that sold out first last time classic black remember you get a full manual and an instruction guide but it's really kind of goof proof because once you engage the power that's when you see the little buttons or the automatic functions but then you get this great twister jar recipe book because that 130 dollar twister jar what i call the, the twist and shout carafe is included and then of course the spectacular spatula as well. Oh, what do you have for me? I'm okay. just delivering you a drink. Why, thank you. Oh my gosh, look how good that is. Oh, that's good. So salads and, mm. you know, you could do cauliflower crust, you could do breads or focaccias. Oh, wow, this is good, Casey. That's delicious. Mm. Pineapple caramel. Nice. I, already, I feel healthier just looking at my blend tech blender. Uh, uh, <laughs> we do. And hey, by the way, again, Boho Funk, I will get with Victoria and with Amanda oh, yeah. behind the scenes. I'll get that recipe for the avocado ice cream and I will put that on my Facebook after the show. Um, I don't think they're going to reserve the adult beverages for me, but... <laughs> 
Here's hoping. I'll make sure uh, someone has it. <laughs> okay. You are coming back at mm -hmm. 7 o'clock in the morning live. That's it. Sounds good. I'll be here. All right. Thanks for Facebooking, everyone. I'm actually live with Mike Mizak for two hours in our coin collector vault. And uh, we, well, we're women. Let's celebrate International Women's Day. Yes, let's yeah, do that. You deserve a blender or at least a drink. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> or both. <laughs> Friday is International Women's Day. Celebrating the